Yup, it's me. I'm alive. It's still ugly. But before I start this video, there's a little disclaimer. Ask your parents before using any of the materials that I'm using in this video. Good? Good. Okay, let's get right into the video. Today, we are becoming backyard scientists. And in order to do that, we need a few simple things. And by the way, I found all these things in my home. Just so you know. To start it off, we need to clear off our desk. Next, we need an empty bottle. Then, we need some Alka-Seltzer. Then, we're gonna need some food coloring. <laughs> you thought I was gonna do the base boost, huh? Well, guess what? You're wrong. And lastly, some vegetable oil. That's pretty much it. Now you're all set. Alright, here's the bottle, and yes, I cut my finger today, that's where there's tape, and I'm going to pour the vegetable oil into the plastic bottle. 2,000 years late. Next, we pour in the water. Actually... Just so you know, I am going to regret this later on. I'm recording this because I wanted to get you guys a close-up view of what you should be doing. I did pour a little too much the first attempt, but trust me, it will work out perfectly well at the end. Now that you have the oil and the water in, you're going to want to use the food coloring because this is going to give you like a nice, cool, cool look to it, as you can say. Alright. Now that I got the Alka-Seltzer open, you're going to want to put two in because I used a 32 ounce bottle. And now, you just see what happens. This first attempt didn't go as I wanted it to go, so I decided to retry again. And the results of the second attempt is way better than the first one. Trust me. I'm not going to lie though, it is pretty cool to look at this from the first attempt. It's so beautiful all right like i said before attempt number two is a go because the first one didn't go as well as i wanted so basically for attempt number two i basically poured out a little bit of the vegetable oil because i did pour too much and so i decided to pour more water in and then just and just look at the results i decided to also put some more alka seltzer to make it jump more if you know what i mean and the results are just wow like look at that that is pretty cool. It's it's causing a chemical reaction for all that stuff to happen. I'm not going to really explain it because I'm not, uh, you know, a smart scientist myself, but I'm a, I'm a I'm pretty smart enough to actually make this work. I'm just I'm actually shocked. This is you guys should try this. All right, after all those steps, you finally have made your lava lamp. You could also, if you really wanted to, get an LED light, any sort of color, and put it under the bottle of what you're using. And you can make it glow, you can make it do cool things. I don't have any, any, you know, LED lights, so I can't really do that, but you guys should try it. It's gonna make it look really cool. Believe me, trust me, it's gonna be epic. Alright, this is a top side view, obviously, but look what happens if you switch around the bottle. That's pretty cool. I'm I'm actually pretty amazed by that. Alright, alright. We're done with everything now. Now there's one more thing we have to do. And you want to know what that is? Now it's time to ask my other fellow scientists of what they think about this project. I don't know. It was trash. It was... No. No. It's trash. It sucks. Nah, man. I'm not going to have it. I'm not going to have it. Bro. You see, your budget was so trash. I throw, I throw my at you, bro. Don't do that. Don't, don't, no, stop. Please. Yeah. Bro, that is so trash. Like, why did you even bother doing it? What is wrong with you? Well, you know what you deserve? Bro, that's, that's trash. That's trash, bro. That's, 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 bro. That's trash, bro. What's up? 
obviously, as you can tell by our very nice, hardworking scientists, that this project was an absolute success. Shout out to everybody who was in this video, and shout out to Miss T uh, for making this, you know, doable for me, for allowing me to actually make a video out of this. And yeah. So today, ladies and gentlemen, I have now officially became a backyard scientist. I hope you guys enjoy the video. You can try this yourselves, but please be careful. And yeah, that was very lovely. I'll see you guys in the next episode. See ya.